Okay then, I've got the uh, infrared camera on and I'm just panning around. You can see the on cold spots around. There's all the targets. Now, <clears throat> just go through the different coloured palettes on it. Shit, these are a bit misted up. <clears throat> now I'll start off there. I can see some of it set up now. The steel target you can see, the woman target, painted black, so it's picking up the heat from the sun better than the uh, other things. Are, as you can see, I'm better with these off. It's all bloody steamed up. Yeah, yeah, no good. Right, see what this one's like. That one is the red hot, I think. There's a black hot, white hot, different palette there, and the multicolour. As you can see, <laughs> so I normally do ratting when I do do ratting. You can see the flagpole there. It's normally in that corner. Now you can focus the actual lens. That's out of focus. I think that's more in focus. I think that's better, isn't it? Uh, that's not so good. Yeah, it's black hot, white hot. <clears throat> and you can also put a target on this, so you can mount it into a little box. And on a pick rail, you can mount it on a rifle. And when you do that, it has got reticles. and you can move the reticle around so what you do you'd fire a shot and wherever the shot went you'd get the reticle and you'd move it to where the shot hit and then that should then be on target like a one stop shot <laughs> so in theory if there was rats around it should pick the heat up from and you switch it on so if you're out and about you don't want that coming up and blowing out in that sound here so just turn your sound off to start off with so there we go 
Uh, can zoom in, I think. Yeah, yeah make the uh, reticle bigger and smaller. So, yeah, not too bad, eh? Three times zoom, look at that. So then folks, that's a quick look at the infrared.